Hey guys, Brian Rose Army here. Welcome to part three of Project Printer. Let's get right into it. So for this episode, we're gonna be fitting the new upper out of the old lower and we're gonna go test fire it and see how it runs. One thing you'll notice is I actually uh, repainted the upper. I used alumahide, stainless steel gray, put two or three coats on and then threw it in the oven and let it bake. This is a much better finish. I also use this on the Uzi and I just really like it. So let's get this old upper off and put the new one on. Pin just comes out, old upper slides off, and then that's it. So this lower receiver is actually an older receiver. So the, um, the older upper receivers, they didn't have a threaded end cap like the new one did. So you can see the difference. This one's threaded, that one's not. They did that to prevent the cracking on the newer ones. Less chance of cracking with high grade ammo with the new ones. But the old ones, they have this, which prevents this upper from going in. So all you have to do is just unscrew. Just one screw and it comes out. Easy as that. And just, the new upper slides are on. And then put the pin back in. And that's it's on now, so I also painted a spare mag I had that was broke, just to match in pictures. I think it looks very, very good. Let's get to the range and see how this upper runs. So I just got back from the range. It's I like the upper, it works very good. Only had one issue and that was a light primer strike. I'm probably just gonna um, put a new spring in, it's like five bucks. So that's that. We are now ready to print a 3D lower. Thank you for watching, have a good day.